Each morning brings new opportunities. Embrace them with open arms and make the most of every moment. Hi loves, welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. How are you all doing? It's been a minute since I last uploaded a video. So in today's video, I'll be taking you guys along with me to spend the day with me. Currently, I'm preparing to go to school. I have classes today. I have an excursion. There's an excursion for the that the faculty organized for us. Then I'll take I'll take you guys along with me if I can as well. And then I'll also be having practicals. I honestly don't know if I can be able to make it for the practicals as well because of the discussion bomb. Let's see how today goes. I'm having cereal for breakfast. At this point, this man, I have this. I'm having cereals, cocoa pops for breakfast. At this point, this is my favorite cereal of all them. I'm just in love. Okay, so voice over Nene here. So I started to pack my bag. These are the stuff that I'll be taking to school with me. My tripod, pen, book, snacks in case I get hungry. Then I started to dress up and I checked myself out in the mirror like, who doesn't do that before going out? So guys, I'm done. I'm done and ready to go to school. I know the weather is it's kind of dark here because the weather is gloomy. It's like it's about to rain. I don't think I'm coming around, but I don't want too much to do it. So, let's get to school. I'm running late. I was on my way to class, and you guys, I didn't even tell you guys, I was having a really bad morning. The shuttle I was inside literally spoiled, so I was late to class. But it was nothing bad. Classes held, and they got out in front of the faculty to board our bus for the trip. My skin. Oh, yeah. Stop for me. Oh, my <laughs> Like my friend said, if you enter a public transport or any Nigerian bus at all and they don't stop at the filling station to get full before your journey starts, that means you entered the wrong bus, like you entered one chance and you need to get down ASAP. So we stop by the filling station to get full alone. So after like two hours journey, we finally reach our destination, the Joao Industrial Company. So we're just waiting outside to get order from them to come inside and I literally tried to interview my friend and then she said this, don't take her serious man. Say hi. So you featured my, my vlog. Feature. Tell us, tell us what, tell us what I We came to go to Bangoro. Who are you talking to? <laughs> I do go Bangoro. Mama, okay. <laughs> We finally got a go ahead to come inside and this was me admiring the whole place. I really didn't know what to expect but it didn't fall below my expectation. Sha. So we are ushered into this very nice executive office. Like it was giving board of directors. I was, I was just feeling I was just feeling like I just arrived. I just arrived. <laughs> like it was nice, it was cool, AC and all that. Then the Malaysia Board of Directors came to address us. They had a slide they put on for us, told us a little bit about the company, how who founded it, how we came about, and many other things that were actually nice to know. And then this was when we had to introduce ourselves. Oh my god, this this was a scary part because I was like I was nervous and I don't know if you can tell from the video, but I was nervous, I was scared, but I did a good job. Watch out, watch out as I introduce myself. Third year, yeah. Um, third year, third year, yeah. I'm Uko Chine, fourth year. Uko Chine, fourth year. That's good. That's my sister. At the introduction, we were taken in batches to the production area, like the industry itself, where they had all the machine they used in producing the drugs. Like, I saw everything I've been taught in class. Not everything, though, but like everything I was taught in class, it was there practically, and it was really nice. I recommend this trip 100%. 
after the trip to the industry house, the industry itself, we came back and we were given a wedding guest spoon. It was really annoying because I was super hungry. I had to wait for them to give me spoon. It was like, I was just laughing, but it was not funny. It was like, if I cannot cry, I will laugh. <laughs> but thank god they later give me a spoon and then i started eating my food like i started enjoying my food the food was actually nice the treatments we got from the industry was superb like i did not really expect it from them but like i'm happy they gave it to us nice trip you guys then this was us on our way back home but as the gen z we are or we were oh sorry as the gen z we are currently we had to like snap pictures and all that so this was us grabbing to take pictures we took pictures with the md and we're just taking personal pictures just give me the lines you need to read and i'll say